people are so strange. One of my colleagues was panicking at work because he accidentally broke a mirror in the bathroom. He kept talking about how it was going to give him seven years of bad luck. It sounds like he's superstitious. There are lots of little things like that that people believe bring good or bad luck. I've never heard of that one before. That's the interesting thing. They tend to be different in different parts of the world. Speaking of mirrors, would you ever place two mirrors across from each other? Maybe the reflections might look cool. True. But in some places, it's believed that doing this opens a door for devils or ghosts to come through. It's interesting how lots of superstitions are connected to the same things, like owls. Owls? You mean the birds? Yes. I've heard that in some places, if you see or hear an owl, it means that bad news is coming. And even worse, if an owl comes into your house, it means that someone in your family will die. Wow. I'd never heard of that one before. I heard of a really weird one from Canada, though. Apparently, if pregnant women are craving fish and don't eat it, they will give birth to a baby with a fish head. No way. Why would anyone actually believe that? I have no idea. A lot of these superstitions have been passed down through so many generations that it's hard to remember the reasoning behind them. They just come from a different time, I suppose. I think my favorite superstition is from Turkey. What is it? Apparently, if you jump over a child, you are cursing them to be short forever. Did someone jump over you when you were a child? That's not funny, John. <laughs>